What's up? This is Robert from Existence First. And once again, I'm filming from the place of my residence since we still need to shelter in place. Now, today's uh, video is about the concept of non-resistance. It's this principle of non-resistance. And what does that mean? Well, when I was in Eastern Religions class in high school, we had to read a book about Winnie the Pooh, right? Winnie the Pooh, that cartoon character or whatever. Um, and the book was called The Tao of Pooh, The Tao of Pooh. And it used actual, like actual situations or scenarios from the Winnie the Pooh series to demonstrate Taoist principles, okay? And one story featured Winnie the Pooh on his way to a birthday party and he was carrying a pot of honey to this birthday party and it was going to be the birthday gift, right? Well, as he's walking, he starts to eat some of the honey, like little by little. By the time he gets to the, uh, his friend's house, the pot is empty, right? He's eaten all of the honey. And at that point, he needs to make a decision, right? I think the average person would, uh, would kind of be upset and panic and think, oh no, like this is a problem. But what he did was as soon as he arrived to his friend's house, he said, hey, happy birthday. I've got you a pot. And so he gave the empty pot as his birthday present to, the, to his friend. Okay. Now, this would be an example of, of utilizing utilizing what, uh, what really is the situation and what cannot be controlled. Like he can't put the honey back into the pot like he already ate it, right? So that is when you, you accept what, what's going on and then you, you utilize that to do your next action, okay? How would we apply this to uh, present day? Okay, well, with the shelter-in-place order, a lot of people panic and they uh, mentally, internally, they label it as something bad. But I don't know, you can't, I mean, what are you going to do? Are you going to go call the county and like overturn this? I don't think so. So, um, so what you got to do then is reach this place of acceptance and then utilization. So you say, okay, now how can I use this time to move forward, right? The same way as Winnie the Pooh used his, uh, used the, the pot as the, the present, okay, how can I use this time at home to, blah, blah, blah. maybe you have like a lot of extra clutter that you need to like clean up, or maybe you need to catch up on reading or something, right? How can you utilize this time? And the way, the reason this works well is because when you ask, how can I utilize this? It presupposes that you've accepted the situation, okay? All right, that's all for now. I'm going to film a few more today and post them throughout the week. So stay tuned, think deeply, and put your existence first.